was founded in 2009 by Demet Mutlu. Since that time, it has grown and expanded to become the largest e trade company. Its headquarters are located in historic city Istanbul. Demet Mutlu attended the prestigious Harvard Business School, but she left before completing her program of study and began her business. The company officially started providing its services in 2010. The legal name of the company is the Trendual Group. It is also known as Trendual.com. Trendual offers a variety of applications for downloading by its users. The most popular apps it provides are Trendual Online All and Modogram. The apps are most frequently downloaded from Google Play and iTunes Connect. Trendual is an e trade platform that serves over 30 million shoppers. 99% of the customers are from the country of Turkey. 1% of the website traffic comes from Azerbaijan, and less than 1% from the United States. It has a delivery service that delivers over 1 million packages every day. Trendual was founded in 2009 by Demet Mutlu. Since that time, it has grown and expanded to become the largest e trade company. Its headquarters are located in historic city Istanbul. Demet Mutlu attended the prestigious Harvard Business School, but she left before completing her program of study and began her business. The company officially started providing its services in 2010. The legal name of the company is the Trendual Group. It is also known as Trendual.com. Trendual offers a variety of applications for downloading by its users. The most popular apps it provides are Trendual Online All and Modogram. The apps are most frequently downloaded from Google Play and iTunes Connect. Trendual is an e trade platform that serves over 30 million shoppers. 99% of the customers are from the country of Turkey. 1% of the website traffic comes from Azerbaijan, and less than 1% from the United States. It has a delivery service that delivers over 1 million packages every day. Trendual.
In many countries, there is a tradition of giving gifts on special days during the year. For example, in China, parents give their children money on New Year's Day. They put the money in small red envelopes. Red is the color of good luck. A lot of peoples, like the Azerbaijanis and the Russians, give presents to their wives, mothers, and sisters on International Women's Day on the 8th of March. They usually give candy, chocolate, or beautiful yellow flowers called mimosas. People often give flowers to their mothers on Mother's Day. That's a special day in many countries, but it is not the same day. In most European countries, it's on the second Sunday of May, but in Spain, it is on the first Sunday of May. The Japanese have an interesting tradition of giving presents in the middle of the year. The present is called Ochikun, which means a mid-year present. They give Ochikun to one another on the 15th of July. They usually give gifts of food or sweets to people that help them during the year. In many countries, there is a tradition of giving gifts on special days during the year. For example, in China, parents give their children money on New Year's Day. They put the money in small red envelopes. Red is the color of good luck. A lot of peoples, like the Azerbaijanis and the Russians, give presents to their wives, mothers, and sisters on International Women's Day on the 8th of March. They usually give candy, chocolate, or beautiful yellow flowers called mimosas. People often give flowers to their mothers on Mother's Day. That's a special day in many countries, but it is not the same day. In most European countries, it's on the second Sunday of May, but in Spain, it is on the first Sunday of May. The Japanese have an interesting tradition of giving presents in the middle of the year. The present is called ochikun, which means a mid-year present. They give ochikun to one another on the 15th of July. They usually give gifts of food or sweets to people that help them during the year. <laughs> 